Hey, here we are at Matt's Music in the Fender Room, and today we're going to show you off quite a few uh, different products. The first one we're going to highlight today is the 1958 reissue of the Jazz Master. Uh, it's been 60 years since the uh, Jazz Master's inception, so Fender has re-released it just like they would have made it uh, back in 1958. The gold pit guard, uh, the way the pickups would have looked on the guitar, all the appointments are true vintage. and. We're going to go through all the sounds today, the rhythm position, the lead position of the pickups. You're going to kind of hear a little bit of everything on this guitar. So come in and try it out. It comes with a nice tweed case, an anniversary case, um, and they're only doing it for this year. This one run of getting it with the nice burst and all the 1958 appointments. Hey, also we're going to spend some time talking about the, the signal chain for the demo video here. Is This is what the Jazz Master was played through. Just a real quick overview of it. We're going into the Boss CP1X. Uh, it's the multi-band compressor. It's a fairly new compressor from Boss. Uh, the brand new JHS Bonsai pedal. I was on the uh, Tube Screamer, the TS10 setting, because I like that old um, TS10, and it does a very good job of emulating that. Uh, then we're fed into a JHS Honeycomb, which is their tremolo pedal, and what's very cool about that is this pedal actually allows you to do two speeds. Uh, so I've got one set to a fast and one set to a slow tremolo. Hopefully you can hear that through the video, how you can manipulate between the two tremolo speeds. Then we're going into a uh, Milkman, which is a multi-tap uh, kind of vintage slapback delay, if you will. Uh, it's another JHS product. Also has a boost function on it so that you can go in and if you're playing a solo and you want to kind of stand out a little bit, uh, you can just utilize it as a boost pedal as well. Then we're going into a ditto. That's what the looper function is. TC Electronics, single one button uh, looper pedal. Nothing, nothing fancy to it. Um, it just does what it does. It has a loop level on it and you basically record what you're doing in. You'll hear that through some of the video. And we're running it, everything through one spot by True Tone. And this is where I'm getting all the juice for the pedals and getting the power. So that's kind of just a real basic signal chain, kind of fits what we're doing into uh, the sounds that I'm getting. Also, too, and behind me, the brains of the operation is the 65 Blackface Deluxe Reverb. Uh, I'm just going straight in on the vibrato channel and I'm just using the reverb on the amp. I've got the reverb set to about three. Uh, there's nothing really you can say about this amp. It's probably the most recorded amp in the history of music um, and they're still making it just like they did back in the 60s. So uh, just a perfect compliment for all the rigs. So you're welcome to come in and play and check out all the great stuff that we have in this room and more importantly the 60th anniversary of this nice Fender Jazzmaster. Mm -hmm. 